Hi, I'm Heather Peppy. I'm a makeup artist and a makeup educator at Cinema Makeup School. I teach beauty and I teach advanced beauty techniques. I have over 15 years experience as a makeup artist. I've worked in all different fields from television, music video, fashion, red carpet, runway, a little bit of everything. So today I'm gonna give you three pro tips on etiquette. The first tip is showing up 15 minutes early, always. In LA, especially a city where traffic is such a big part of our life, that could never ever be an excuse for why you're late to set. So every time I have a job, whatever my call time is, if it's 11.15 or it's 11.30, I check my timing and make sure I'm going to arrive 15 to 20 minutes before my call time. That way it leaves me a little bit of buffer, so if I do sit in a little bit of traffic, I'm not stressed out. If I am going to a private client's house, I never knock on the door before our scheduled appointment time. So if you're doing a do and go for a red carpet for a, a private client and you're arriving at their house, I never like to show up earlier than expected just because it's their own private residence and they may not be ready for you. If it's for a shoot or a professional job at a studio, always 15 to 20 minutes before your call time just to be safe. And then if it's a private client, I always arrive early, make sure I have a good parking spot, but I don't knock on the door until exactly the time of our scheduled appointment. My second pro etiquette tip is always have a set bag prepared and ready to go. No matter what job you're going to, even if you're assisting somebody and they're like, you don't need to bring your kit, always just have a set bag because you always need your set bag. I always have a set bag packed and ready to go with me in my trunk. Anything that I could possibly use, disposables, tissues, alcohol spray, sanitizer, little floss, little picks, maybe disposable toothbrushes, baby wipes always. And then I kind of modify it depending on what that job is. So there's always extra space, but I always have the essentials packed and ready to go to save me time on set. So when I do need to run to set, I can just grab a couple of the touch-up products that I need for my model and then just run and everything else is already ready to go. My third and final pro etiquette tip is to pay attention to your client. When you have a client in the chair, pay attention to their needs and their comfort level. Make sure that you're always aware. Sometimes we're doing things where we're very close to the eye or we're very close to the face. And remember being a makeup artist, we're doing a very intimate job putting makeup on somebody's face. So we always have to respect that and you always wanna make sure that you're paying attention if they feel uneasy at all make sure that you're tuned into that and you let them know try to address it find out what it is are they okay because sometimes it's just paying attention to a look you don't even need to say something but you can tell if you're using too much pressure if they're flinching or if something is painful so just always be aware of your client. Remember, as a makeup artist, what we're doing is you have a human in your chair and we're touching their face. We're seeing them at their most vulnerable and they're raw when they're exposed with no makeup and we're looking for flaws in their face. So remember how uncomfortable that can be for somebody sitting in your chair and always make sure that you have a very high respect for your model in your chair and their comfort level. And we're always very aware of how intimate our job can be. Those are my three etiquette tips. I hope you enjoyed them. Please let us know what your tips are in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks so much, bye.